Welcome to our club. We're going to take a slow stroll today. Because I want to make two videos of this place. It's a combination of a sleepy town, a village, and a major hub. There's a point in there. I've been to Aklo a few times myself. Just um, mainly shopping or passing through or just checking it out for the randomness. Many, many, many years ago I had to get a bus down. Got lost in that one. That's that's a story for another day. It is Sunday morning, so the parking is free, and I'm walking downhill because I don't want you to hear me out of breath when I'm coming uphill. So I didn't really do much research. You know, there's, there's a nice building there, and the, the Sunday Mass is on, I think, or Town Hall meeting. A lot of cinemas closing around Ireland. Sure like most towns in Ireland, Arklo has a central open space which serves as a town square and venue for all the major public gatherings. This parade, ground one, blah 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 blah. I don't want to read all that, I'll be here for half an hour and I'll do it wrong. So, yes. If you want to read up on that, you can pause it. You can go back and pause it. So I held it there for a few minutes. But I do need to cross the road because I remember there was like a little section on the other side of the road that had like a statue or a little kind of square. So I'm gonna have to try to cross this and not die. So. This is Arklo. It's down, you can get the train down, I think. Uh, yeah, the train should come down to here, possibly. Yeah, it does, I think, I don't know. Uh, but you can get the motorway, you can get a bus down, anyway. Uh, so there's more information on it there. Oh, more information over here, but there's a corner here, so I don't know. No, not the so. yes, we should be all right. Just be careful with people with their indicators. I noticed that a lot here in Ireland people put their indicators on for the tour ages ago, but it'll still stay on. Even after you've done the turn, so it can be a bit misleading. And here's some more information. The main walk of the town, Arklow Heritage Trail, and then a more detailed map. You get the beach. <laughs> I always laugh when I think of beaches in Ireland. <laughs> They're probably like. 10 days a year that the beach is any use. Every other time it's just freezing cold. So there is a heritage trail. Yeah, so you'll see all the history now. Men's haircuts. Get them in. Cafes, I know there's a lot of cafes springing up over the years now. You can get kind of nice coffee and food and all. So don't be afraid to pop into these little 
pop-up place and of course your old traditional pub Chinese takeaway there's a beauty McMullins oh, well, let me see we might actually have a nice thumbnail here uh, it's not the best we'll, we'll see if we can get a better one um, yeah laser and beauty so like you know this will be the main street that you'll have sorry if the car noise is overtaking my voice and um, so here's your buses that you can get uh, nothing no information at the moment so it looks like the 384 005 and number two bus uh, there's plenty of car parks it's a nice fancy library give me a bit more of an angle there with the newly renovated There's another cafe. Yeah, I could spend a week here trying out all the cafes, but I don't drink coffee. I don't drink tea, so I couldn't give my um, honest opinion on what's good. This is the little square here. So yeah, there's a view, I believe, here. Some benches, parks, nice little auditorium or gazebo. Is it a gazebo? Oh, actually, hold on, we can take a look at this. It looks like a muriel tiled. Oh, let's see if we get this into focus. There we go. It looks like they'd have a fire going there. Let's see if we can take a little stroll over here and see if we can get a nice little view. Ah, nothing more beautiful than a 1970s building. It's different to I'm pretty sure that car park wasn't there when I was last here, which was in 2000. And Five, I believe. So we're going back 15 years ago. Uh, I'll try to get a screenshot there if you want to read up on all the history. Uh, St Mary's Park Cemetery Origins, Parish Church. A lot of people in the cemetery. And we have a Paddy Power, so we know that's the gambling place. I've, I've said that place many times before. Souvenir shop. Church bells are ringing. I wonder if anyone's singing. Right, fun fair. I assume that's a casino. Don't know. So, in the last 20 years, a big shopping centre was opened up here on the other side of the river. Um, and it's a popular destination. many many years ago this used to be the main road so you had to actually take this road to get through our club but now with the m11 you can kind of ring road around it so we have pizzas we have a butchers we have some government official who does nothing but gets paid loads you know uh, all this kitchen so that'd be like a local restaurant so probably give her a try Uh, Computoc. Ooh, some houses over there. So let's see if we see what the prices are. Don't know if people liked or didn't like the prices of houses in the last video. So we'll do it now. Well, a lot of them look like they're sold. And what they sold for is probably different from the price that's here. So, two hundred and twenty thousand, three twenty-five. 180 grand, 210, 260,000. So it's it's up there with prices. It's not cheap. 
it's not cheap because it's it's not too far from Dublin and it's a, it's a big enough hub now it's before 12 o'clock so a lot of the pubs haven't opened up looks yeah. like the back room the pub, the smoking area bit of renovation going on health and safety beauty nail technician 